Well, hello guys, YouTube, internet, Facebook, people. Um, I'm going to be taking a little bit of a detour off the usual blog or uh, video diary, video entry. And we are going to be assembling uh, the the cannon, the little black powder cannon here. You want to you wanna take a look real quick? Check it out. It's a gun. So we're assembling a base for it, and this should be a two-parter. We're going to be uh, building the base today, and then we're going to be firing it. So uh, should I don't know if it's going to be one video or we're going to make a sequel to it. I don't think we're going to. I think we're going to get this video out today, and then uh, have the video later of us firing it. So. Uh, so, uh, Sean, we're starting to get this, uh, assembled, and, uh, this is the assembly process. Mm -hmm. That is the base. Let's, can I get, can I get a shot of this base real quick? Oh. <laughs> El Spiso. Yeah. Um, so, how long do you think this assembly process is going to take? Oh, I don't know. If we stop procrastinating and actually get it done, it won't take long. Okay, thoughts or feelings about the assembly and or firing of this, uh... I'm excited. I want to shoot it again. It's been a while. Anyways, uh, so... So, we're at step, uh, what would you say? Step... 2000, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> um, getting the... The, uh... Brace. This is a bracing bolt, if you will. So I'm here. Uh, Sean's doing some uh, things with uh, this bolt. And this, I'm pretty much in the way. Flush cut. Great, great cut. Uh, St. Thomas Harrison so has an artillery division. Where's the Dremel? The, the Dremel? Yeah, the Dremel. Uh -huh. I know. There it is. Well, the sandpaper isn't going to work very good on bolt. steel. Yeah. You have a file? Well, while we're waiting for Sean here, um, let me just describe the sort of a process what we're doing here. Is, uh, this is a replica uh, like 45 caliber pistol ball. Um, of a naval cannon or something. It shoots, it takes black powder, you put a fuse in it and fire it. Uh, we did have a base before and uh, it's pretty gnarly, it's pretty dangerous actually. I don't know if we should be doing this, but we're doing it anyways because we don't care. Um, but uh, you alright over there? Okay then. Um, but he's uh we're assembling a base. We need to get the base going because we've we've shot it more than probably a hundred times, and uh, some things that uh, we need to be conscious about is just the actual wear on the base itself. If you know the concussion and the recoil, we'll rattle it apart, rattle it loose, and uh, things like that. All right. Well, we just finished the step here. We've installed this bolt with washers. And what that was for is when I had put these two side pieces in, cut slot out in the bottom, slid them in flush with wood glue, but they were spread apart too far at the top. And the cannon was sitting in there real sloppy, gave it a little bit of play this way. So I installed this bolt there to kind of tighten them up a little bit, bring them closer together, and uh, should fit in there nicely now. Alright. Now our next step. Pretty much just drill out holes so that the cannon can fit down in there. And uh, pretty simple. Oh, this is uh, this is process numero um, 2001. 2001. There was a lot of you know, just using power tools and. A lot of work to be done here. A lot of work to be done. 
measuring and how does it fit? That's good. Okay. No need to drill another hole. All right. Um. You don't need straps. That'll hold it. Shit. You're lightening it. <laughs> Almost done. Doing, doing a couple, couple more things. Are you gonna cut this flush then? Shoot, no. Damn. <laughs> we need to have our first ammunition chain shot. That can only be safe. Okay, well, we are almost done here. We have a few more assembly steps to do. Uh, put on the top straps and the wheels, and we will be shooting a firing uh, video here. A sequel to this video you're watching now. So, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. I don't know if you're going to want to subscribe. Our videos are kind of uh, ridiculous. But, thanks for watching, and peace be with you. Check out our little wheels. The wheels. Anyways, um, shut up! Way to ruin my shot. You need a sharpie. Don't be sniffing all that marker now.